right, we're out here at uh, Shabona Lake today, Shabonah. We're gonna try some fishing today. Uh, see what happens. Got the campsite set up. So we got all day just to mess around. We might even catch a fish. We're gonna head across the lake and go to the bait store right now. Haven't taken this boat out for a long time. We got the depth finder going. We got bait. We got gas. We got the umbrella. Now all we need is to go get some fish. Well, a little breeze kicked up here. So now we can do some, some nice drift fishing. Breeze has picked up considerably. Well, so much for the breeze. <laughs> it blew for about five minutes and quit. All right, we got something here. All right, now it's time for a beer. Our first largey. Nice fish. Wow. There's yeah. another one, folks. We got another one on within five more minutes. What this one is. It seems pretty decent. Who knows here? You can have musky, walleye, bass. As far as the bigger fish, you know. Might like a walleye because it's going down, you know. That bass was jumping like a crazy bit. Oh man, this is big. Holy smolies. Catch a man. This is it's a walleye. It's a walleye. Nice one I'll too. It's a, if it's 18, it's a keeper. Wow, nice one. It's 18. Oh, oh, my, it's cold. Oh, hard to get them with these for fighting different. I don't think this is no 18, but uh, 16. Nice 16 inch walleye. Gotta let them go. Are you nuts? Wait, we think Anthony's got one. That's what the reel's for. And you got a fish on? Yeah. Oh, no. Shh, come on. Anthony says he's got one here. Yeah, weeds. He got one. He's all right. Mm -hmm. All right, Anthony says he's got one this time. I believe. We'll see. Again? Uh, not again. Holy fuck. What? What? Man. It... Here we go. Hook up. Sure felt like it. It's like it's something. It's like or it's and Dude, there's no seaweed or anything. No, we're in 30 feet of water. So, no, he's, I'm sorry again, folks. <laughs> Maybe next time. Third time's the charm. Set. We got uh, the screen enclosure, which really is nice if the bugs come out. It's pretty good. There ain't no bugs now. Tent, van, boat, screen house, and the fire pit. We're ready to eat some dinner. <clears throat> and we're hungry. I'm starving. How about you? Did you have breakfast? Oh, well, we got the Italian sausage with some peppers and onions and some red sauce and some jardinara. Coffee's ready for tomorrow. We got some fried chicken cooking in the grill. I had it from a graduation party, so we're using everything up. We got salad, broccoli salad. Cheers. Mm. It's 
poppers are great. Mm -hmm. So now it's uh, 9 p.m. and uh, ready for bedtime. Certain people are in bed already and um, I'll be up till the wood's gone. Okay, we got a big old raccoon. I'm walking into this camp here. I'm like pretty aggressive. I had to fight him off with the chair. We had raccoons last night tearing up the camp. Yeah, they actually went in the cooler tore the oat milk open how the hell did they go in the cooler you gotta like bungee everything skunks got me once but raccoons never got me this bad at least they didn't get our our coffee creamer ha 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 but they ate our cereal they got the worms that we had they ate our potato chips they got they they drank the milk. They went into the freaking cooler, man. Do you believe that? They went in the cooler. Lucky they didn't get all the the coffee. Yeah, they got us real good. At least we got our coffee though. They didn't get that. And the cream. And that's it. The raccoons broke in the, the screen out. They actually went in the cooler. Drank our oat milk that we were going to have cereal. Ate the bananas. Ate the two pieces of leftover chicken. What else? Oh, ate our bag of potato chips. Ate the bait we had, the worms and the... Uh, uh, spikes, wax worms. Made a mess. That's pretty good. I heard them all night, but I wasn't going to get up and like chase raccoons around in the middle of the night, you know. Ah, they got to eat too.
see what we could get today. So we're trolling here, and boom, my hand's on the throttle, and I look back. There's a freaking snake in my motor. Did he get caught in there somehow? I don't know if he's injured. Want to try knocking him off with his oar? No, I'm going to grab him by the back of the head and pull him out of there. Got him. Yeah, he's fucked. He's all fucked up, man. Can you raise the motor somehow and get him out? No, I'm trying to pull him through. What the fuck? How did he get up in the motor? Oh, man. I got him out of there. He's one pissed off snake, I'll tell you that. There he goes. Wow, that was weird. Freaked me out.